For what purpose does the gentleman from Kansas seek recognition? Uh, Mr. Speaker, I ask to address the House for one minute and to revise and extend my remarks. Without objection, the gentleman from Kansas is recognized for one minute. Uh, Mr. Speaker, America has lost a statesman, noble war hero, and service-minded Kansan who never forgot where he came from. Senator Bob Dole died peacefully at the age of 98, having left his district, state, and this country better for the many contributions he made over 75, 79 years of public service. I was blessed to spend some time with Senator Dole a few weeks ago. His love for Kansas and his people were on full display in his excited curiosity about our plans for the big first district. He was a thoughtful, committed, and energetic champion for our nation and our way of life in rural Kansas. He always treated others with respect and kindness, especially his fellow veterans, as he attended nearly every honor flight that came to Washington, D.C. He was a fierce advocate for the political views, but he was equally committed to cross aisle friendship and camaraderie. I left our time together inspired and commissioned as Senator Dole made it clear that we must never forget where we come from. He knew deep down that the heartbeat of our nation lies in places like his hometown of Russell, Kansas. His legacy will echo into the future and his patriotic spirit serves as a benchmark for anyone who believes that our brightest days are yet to come. Thank you, Senator Dole, for working tirelessly to make our world a better place. May you rest in peace. My prayers and gratitude to Senator Bob Dole and his family. With that, I yield back.